A petition with more than 19,000 signatures handed over at the FBI offices here in Denver. The people who signed it demanding the Department of Justice investigate the deadly shooting of 17-year-old Jesse Hernandez killed by a Denver police officer. Now, Denver police say Jesse was behind the wheel of a stolen car when she rammed into an officer last month. Supporters of Jesse not giving up, holding another vigil for that teen this evening. 7 News reporter Molly Hendrickson is live there right now. And Molly, this vigil just wrapping up. Actually, Ann, it is just getting started a little bit later than we expected. About 50 people gathering here about a block away from where Jessica Hernandez was shot and killed by police last month. And you can see they're lighting candles, holding signs, calling for justice. Many of them signed that petition demanding the Department of Justice to investigate Denver police for shooting the teen. They say they're fed up with police violence and civil rights violations. We're just here paying our respects, praying, and, and trying to start have a conversation about healing this wound in this neighborhood, in our families, and in the young people who are terrorized and traumatized by, by the police. Tonight's vigil, they say, is also about healing and to start a conversation in the community about what needs to be done to make sure that this type of violence never happens again, in their words. We're live in Denver tonight. Molly Hendrickson, 7 News. Thanks.